Alright guys, welcome back to Mr. of King of Deliverance. For? This time we're continuing with Tough Love. I'd like to ask if... Ah, this knee of mine hurts like hell. Um, I'd like to ask... Young man, young man, there's always someone who wants to ask something. What do you need? I wondered if you could take a look in your books for me, and uh... Books? God above, am I to shuffle around here with my knees the way they are? Um... The bailiff sent me. That's another matter, then. What do you need, friend? Is it possible to find out from the records where someone lives? You think we keep records of every serf? For Christ's sake, they breed like rabbits. But... But I thought that in the rat house, though, in, in, in the books... Boy, the books are for recording pacts, undertakings, punishments, property rights, and so forth. In other words, important things. We don't keep records of serfs. Eliska won't be happy about that. Eliska? You don't mean the one who married into the Mishek family? Yes. Yes, you know her. Why wouldn't I? I used to play dice with old Mishek years ago. He had a son. A nice, polite lad. How is he? Tied up? Oh, uh, you know, he's... He's quite tied up these days. Well, if you see him, tell him to swing by. And where are the Mishaks living now? A stone's throw from Rate by the small fish pond. Thanks. Okay. From. So where do I go? Go and see Lishka's husband's family. Okay, so where would he? Where is he located? Down that way, okay. This is a nice farm. A really nice farm. I wonder, is these, are they in here? Somewhere? <clears throat> um. Excuse me. Elderly woman. What is it now? Um. I've got information about your daughter-in-law. <laughs> Eliska's fine, only she needs... Never heard of her. Get lost. She's, your, She's your nearest kin. Eliska's part of your family, and she really needs you... I won't help anyone. I could make it worth your while. Really? And what is it you want? Your son's widow needs help. She has nowhere to go. What do I care about some useless girl? Hmm. She could help you with the farm. She definitely knows how to take care of things. A bit of help would come in handy. Send her here, then. But don't let her think she'll be taking it easy. She'll have her work cut out. That sounds quite... And if I hear a peep out of her, I'll take a stick to her back. Fine salvation this is. All right, Alishka. Where are you at, girl? Down there? All right, let's, let's go. All right, Herman. We need to talk. <clears throat> Alishka's looking better. She is, but she's not happy. God sent the poor girl great trials. Indeed. Did you know her whole family was wiped out by the plague? She was barely twelve. I... Losing your family isn't easy. Ah. Sorry, I wasn't thinking. So, did you find out anything about that kin of hers? I have. I tracked them down. <coughs> they say they take her in, but I'm not sure if she'd do well there. Leave that to her. I just hope she'll be better off than now. Okay, so where is she? Oh, there she is. You're not crying now? I'm not. I've wept enough for a lifetime. It's a bit of a change since my last visit. I haven't had much luck in my life. But I've always worked things out in the end. Tears are no help to anything. That's true. 
So did you find out something about them? I did. I found your husband's father and mother and uh, they're willing to take you in. But... But nothing. They'd give you a home. Then that's a real family. You're right. I'll have another talk with Herman. Alright, Herman. Wanna talk about it? Where'd you go, buddy? Oh, come on. Are you sure you wanna let her go? I mean, she's a beautiful woman, you know, you could... I've heard the way you talk about her, and, um... Would you like Eliska to stay? You know how... She was always the sweetest girl. When she came with her family to retire, still single, she was a sight to behold. And it might surprise you, but she even had a word or two for me now and again. It grieved me when she married that wastrel. It was a foolish idea, but I always thought maybe she and I could... Well, fate likes a good laugh. Now I've strung up her old man, I have her under my roof. After all the years I was thinking of her. I don't want her to leave, but I don't want her to be unhappy here either. Mm hmm. So it's my decision. Well, he wants her to be happy, so. I guess we'll send her off. Um. Have you made your mind up? I can't decide. I don't know Mishikskin at all. But at least I'd have a family. Herman could give you a family too. He's a decent, upright fellow. I've met none better, and that's the honest truth. But he's an executioner. And what's the problem? That the other women won't chat with you down at the creek? Did that sort of gossip ever interest you anyway? He's a fine man, isn't he? He's willing to take care of you, and he has the means to do it. And he wants you. He's so sick with love for you, he can't even sleep. But did he really say that? He told me he's been in love with you for years. He said he always thought you were the sweetest girl in Ratai. That's true. We used to meet now and again and exchange a few words. I... Well, he always treated me nicely. By all that's holy... You're right! I'll stay here. There you go. Herman? Yes? Could I... Can I stay here with you? You mean for good? If, if, if you don't want me to... I... You can! By God, you can! <laughs> <laughs> You've made me the happiest man in the world. <laughs> Oh, that was nice. So, Herman, how you how you tough flow oh it's complete. Oh, okay. Let me let me just let me just eat from here. <sighs> Alright guys, so on this episode right here. Let's subscribe, share, comment if you guys enjoyed it. And I'll see you guys next episode. Peace out everybody.